What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In this video, I've got another Bio Nano Genomics update for you, ticker symbol BNGO. They just announced yesterday one of their biggest share offerings to date. They keep doing these pretty massive uh, share offerings to raise capital. And as we can see right now, shares are absolutely crashing and are down about 15% on the day. I saw as, uh, the shares go as low as down 17%, but as we can see right now, it is rallying a little bit back up and trying to break uh, up from the lows. So we're going to go over all of the different information surrounding bio nano genomics and exactly what you need to be looking out for in this share offering and for some other news that is coming out about this company in the near future. So if you enjoy this video, please go down and hit the like button and hit the subscribe button. It really helps me get this information out to as many people as possible you get to stay up to date on all of your favorite stocks and learn about a couple of new ones so yesterday when this news came out there were no details about what the actual share amount would be the price that the uh funds were going to be raised at in terms of the stock price and the amount that they are looking to raise but today we got some new updates we can see that they priced a 200 million dollar underwritten stock offering at a discount of six dollars a share selling 33.3 million shares and the stock closed on tuesday at an all-time high of nine dollars and 14 cents now, what's going to be really important coming up in the next couple of weeks is when they file their prospectus and it becomes public knowledge. We can go in there and see exactly what the use of these funds is going to be for. My prediction is that it's going to be for general corporate purposes, uh, research and development, and pursuing strategic opportunities with other businesses. And that's going to mean that they're looking for companies to acquire or merge with, which in general is good news. But they keep doing this these massive share offerings, and they're diluting uh, the share positions, which is not a great sign for the stock. But there is some something that I want to take a look at. So if we go back a little bit in the chart, we can see that right here, the stock was trading at about $5.01. This was the last massive share offering that they did. And right after market closed, they announced that they were going to be raising the funds at $3.05. We can see throughout the day, we saw the stock fall from about the $5 mark all the way down to the $4, low four uh, teens. And then you can see right here that the next day, the stock absolutely ripped up. So I'm predicting that after this pretty massive decrease in share price, BioNanoGenomics is going to have a strong rest of the week just because it has a lot of inv uh, good investor sentiment because everybody knows that this company is actually legit now. It's no longer just a little biotech penny stock. They're the real deal. And it's something that everybody needs to put on their watch list and be looking out for. If we look a little bit further in this chart, we can see that over the past week, Bio Nano Genomics has had a pretty substantial run up from around the mid $5 mark all the way up to its high at around 917. Now, this was because it had its had its annual uh, cytogenomics symposium where they were doing a lot of showcases and product demonstrations and real uh, life testimonials of its Sapphire system. So if we take a look at the news from the fifth day, which is, in my opinion, one of the more important days of this symposium, we can see that Sapphire identifies structural variants that may predispose to severe pandemic illness. Now, essentially what they're going to be able to do is figure out which types of individuals have a higher susceptibility to come down with severe symptoms and transmit this illness to others. And they might be able to figure out some treatment options based on the different genetic predispositions which is going to be very important. Now, they announced some other different things uh, in this symposium. Mainly, it all had to do with the Sapphire just being a more cost-effective solution and providing a, a better service than anything else on the market today. We can also see that Bio Nano Genomics is being held by a pretty large institution. Now, if we come over here, this is whalewisdom.com. We can see what all of the big traders and investment firms are holding. Now, Vanguard owns about five and a half million shares of Bio Nano Genomics, and at the time, uh, it was worth about $3.6 million. Now, this is outdated. I, I definitely need to tell you guys that it's outdated as of September. So the 13F filings are all of the filings are coming out 
throughout this month and a little bit into next month. So it is good to see that Vanguard has a five and a half million share position in bio nano genomics. But I think we're going to see this number increase drastically when all of these companies release their 13Fs in the near future. I think we're going to see more companies that are as popular as Vanguard. Maybe we'll see a BlackRock. Maybe we'll even see uh, ARC. We can look at ARC on a day to day basis. But uh, in the near future, I'm predicting that ARC is going to buy some bio nano genomics because Kathy Wood has such a heavy emphasis on genomic stocks. She's tweeted about it in the past. She thinks it's the future. Uh, she keeps buying a lot of telehealth uh, companies, especially uh, TDOC. Uh, she just has a very heavy emphasis on the new wave um, of healthcare. So I think bio nano genomics fits that mold pretty decently. And I think that this dip is going to be one that they are going to be considering to buy. If we come over here as well, we can see that bio nano genomics also has a very heavy short interest. If we come down a little more, we can see that there are 8.48 million shares held short right now. So essentially what that means is that people are selling shares that they do not own collecting a premium for the sale of those shares, and then hoping to buy their position back to close it at a lower price, and their profit will be the difference between what they had to uh, buy the shares back for and what they sold them for. So right now, the shorts are doing pretty well on bio nano genomics. I'm predicting a short squeeze in the near future if these individuals and institutions keep holding on to their short position, just because this company has such a high uh, ability to create a lot of FOMO buying. We can see right here, there was a lot of FOMO buying up into the top here before it had a pullback. And now we can see it went up again. It is making a higher low, in my opinion, and in, uh, bio nano genomics is not going to crash below the $7 mark, uh, even though the share offering was around $6. I think throughout the rest of the week, this company is going to go up a lot. Now, if we take a look over here, this is something very interesting that I found, and I think you guys are going to want to take a look at it. So BioNanogenomics recently came out with its option chain. So it doesn't have any super long-term contracts yet, but there's a lot of things that you can do with this, especially with a new option chain. If we take a look over here, we can see that the deep in the money calls for August of 2021, the $2 strike, you can get them for about $6.20 was the last price. That means that your break even on this trade, if you bought one contract of bio nano genomics, would be $8.20. That means that you're predicting that bio nano genomics will go to $8.20 cents or more by August of 2021. And what's great about this is that you would be able to purchase two, uh, 100 shares of bio nano genomics per contract that you buy. So it is pretty expensive. Uh, for a deep in the money contract like this, it actually is pretty cheap. The implied volatility is absolutely ridiculous. But since these contracts are so deep in the money, uh, I think there's not really a problem with doing this if you want to exercise at the $2 strike. I'm thinking about buying a couple of these just because I think bio nano genomics could be an unbelievable company in the near future and if it goes to maybe $15 by August and you own the right to purchase them at $2 that's an unbelievably great trade so that's going to be it for this video if you guys enjoyed what I had for you in this one please go down and hit the like button and hit the subscribe button it really helps me get this information out to as many people as possible and please comment down below your thoughts if you're going to be looking at these deep in the money calls for bio nano genomics because I definitely am I think that's a really actually smart trade to take, especially on this dip today. So I'll see you guys in the next video and I hope you're having an unbelievably profitable trading day.